Hello and welcome to Warhammer 40k for new players where I'm going to get shared tips, hints and other ways to help you get into the hobby. Now for today we're going to do a top 5 and it's top 5 hits, top 5 hints, tips to start a new army or start your army. Well, number 1, this is quite simple and look at the models you like. These, get the models that you like will look of. Warhammer 40k has a very vast and diverse amount of armies and looks. There's their heavy powered armoured space marines or their corrupted brethren and even these look completely different. Maybe it's demons. Maybe you like the live sexual look of its Lanesh. Or the absolute acid trip that is. Zinch. Or maybe going to Zinch, maybe you like the Egyptian look of a thousand suns. Or my favourite, the sleek aesthetic of the Aldar. And when you start this way, it makes it easier for you to build your army. It makes, you, it, makes it more interesting because you're doing something that you like the look of. And it makes, it just it helps you get more immersed into a game and help your hobby get better. Second one. Start simple. Now I know I do my Warhammer on a budget videos. Uh, which, are, which is a budget of £150 is to start a big army to start straight away but if you're, if you're a bit nervous about starting a big army like that start simple a start collecting box is perfect for this you get a nice range of models you get a nice range of different methods of battle and different types of units it's, they are quite diverse um, as I mentioned my Nurgle one you have, you know, you have your fast attack and your troop choices there and the Tau one's good because you have your nice big battle suits and your Ethereals, your Tau, Firecast, and you have your drones. Or, you know, something even a bit more basic, such as the Militarium Tempestus, which has just one troop, one or two troop choices, your Commissar, and a Torox. You can make a HQ unit and an Elite unit as well. So you'd have a HQ, Elite. But start simple. This also means that. If you're not finding them fun to paint, it's going to be easier for you to change. And when, so that's basically that bit. Third, ask for help. Warhammer 40k community is actually pretty good. It's a nice community. It's quite mellow. It's quite, yeah, there's going to be a bit of banter, but it's not as toxic as what people say it is. It's quite a laid-back community. And you ask questions about how to help you paint, how, about the rules, you're going to get genuine answers. You're going to get people saying, you know, you do this, or no, this is where you're mistaken. You know, and people could you discuss the rules and they'll help you. They're not going to belittle you, they're not going to sh shout you down. They're going to be helpful with you guys. Next, whoops, I should, don't worry about your painting. Honestly, you're new to the hobby, don't worry about this. Ever doesn't start as pro. My Instagram, these are the models that I painted. As you can see, to a pretty good standard now, but I'm saying at the moment. But it is a pretty good standard. But if you go keep, if we look down, you can see they are some worse. And some like this one, this one's not a great painting one, I just enjoy one. You know? That's the thing. You're going to get better. Don't worry about, you know, being the best painter straight away. Enjoy it. And you'll get better as you go along. And finally, don't deep dive into the lore. I know it's tempting, there's many novels, there's many books, there's audiobooks, you know, there's the codexes. If you're interested in an army, watch a couple of YouTube videos, read the Wikipedias, you don't look at the amount of books and get suddenly overwhelmed with so much choice. Focus on the army that you've chosen, watch a couple of videos on it, see if you like the lore, and then continue. Don't worry too much about anything else. 
and that's basically it. To sum up, choose an army that you like the look of, keep your start simple, ask people for help, don't worry about your painting at the start, and look at the law of the army you've chosen. And that's it. Anyway, thank you for watching. If you want to save money on Warhammer 40k, check the link for this, uh, down below for Element Games. And if you want to support me in a more personal way, I've dropped the link for my two books, my two comics. Because I don't want to use Patreon, I don't want to monetize my videos. I want you guys to at least get something for supporting me, rather than just handing me money or you know getting money from YouTube. Just something. I'd rather. Like, even if it's a discount on Warhammer, I'd, I'd rather you just get something out of it. Anyway, like I said, thank you for watching. Like, subscribe, leave a comment if you've got any questions. And I'll see you all soon.